A popular saying in medical school has long been, see one, do one, teach one, meaning that young doctors are expected to learn as they go. But one new technology is changing the way doctors prepare for surgery. As we hear from our medical correspondent, Dr. John LaPook. Dr. Neil Kantak is a first year plastic surgery resident at Harvard Medical School. I don't think that anything we do in surgery is natural. I think most of these movements are things that people are not born with the coordination to do. So Dr. Kantak and others come here to Beth Israel Deaconess Medical Center's skills lab to practice laparoscopic surgery, procedures done through tiny incisions. Good. The hope is extra surgery training can lower complication rates for patients and costs for insurers. When you make the right move, the tissue gets split in the way that it would if you're in the operating room. The virtual surgery simulator uses touch feedback to help surgeons hone motor skills, like picking up small objects and knot tying they will need in an operating room. What the simulation lab allows us to do is develop the coordination so that when someone tells us this should be your next move, you have the ability to actually do it with your hands. The virtual training taking place in labs such as this breaks away from methods students have traditionally used, including practicing on live patients. We're able to let surgeons in a safe environment do these operations to get feedback on how they're doing. Some will do very well, some not so well. The hope is to bring these kind of simulators to hospitals and medical centers across the country. I think that the only way to get good at doing a particular surgery, doing a particular type of operation, is to do it over and over again. And now, with virtual simulators, he can do just that. Of course, these simulators teach doctors nothing about clinical judgment. That rust, they're going to have to learn the old-fashioned way, one flesh-and-blood patient at a time. Okay, Dr. John LaPook, thank you very much.